Okay, I want introduce about the Wheatstone Bridge. The Wheatstone Bridge is an electrical bridge circuit used to measure resistance. This bridge consists of a galvanometer and two parallel branch containing four resistor. One parallel branch contains one known resistance and one unknown. The other parallel branch contains resistor of non resistance. To operate the bridge, a voltage source is connecting to the terminal of the bridge. That's all. Thank you. The objective of our project is first to design a whetstone bridge circuit to simulate light sensor. Second, to design a PCB considering all the given design rules. This is our circuit for the our project. We made the light detector circuit using Wheatstone Bridge. The component that we are use are LDR transistor, LM741 op amp IC, potential meter, resistor, LED, and 9 volt battery.
light detector or light sensor is a device or circuit that detect the intensity of the light incidence on it. Different types of light detectors are LDR or, or light dependence resistor, photodiodes and phototransistor. Next, all these devices are called a photoelectric device as they convert light energy to electric energy. This light detector or sensor can detect different types of light like visible light, ultraviolet light and infrared light. This is our light sensor circuit. It can be configured as either shadow detector of light detector which means it can detect the intensity of light. Right now in the circuit diagram it is configured as light detector. The mean the LED will turn on when when LDR is dark. We can change this circuit as shadow detector by simply swapping the pin 2 and 3 of LM741 of MIC and the LED will turn off when LDR is dark. Here is our light detector circuit diagram. With stone bridge is consist of one LDR and potential meter in the first arm and two no resistance of 10k ohm in the second arm. As the light incident on the LDR, if the system get low and the voltage through point C is increased in the comparison with the point D, and or MIC741 is used to compare the voltage of both the point C and D. If the voltage of point C is more than point D, then the ohm M gives high output and if Point D has more voltage than one then of M give low output. As the of M output is high, it turns on the transistor and the LED start glowing. And it low the of M output is low, the transistor remain in off condition, which means the LED is dark. For the discussion, I would like to discuss about the problem that we face during the process of constructing our project. For the first problem is, our LED burn out because the excess current flow from the power source which are 9 volt. Next, another problem is bad connection. This problem occurs when we solder the component at the donut board by double checking the solder joint we managed to overcome this problem. Lastly, we failed to identify the positive and negative terminal of the component due to our lack of knowledge about the electric component. But after a while, by refer the book and internet, we have gained a lot of knowledge about the electric circuit. For the conclusion that we have conclude from our project is we learn on how the principle of the weak stone bridge is applied in circuit. We also gain knowledge on the further application of the light sensor that we use on most of major industries. By having this application, we can conclude that when the simple light detector circuit can be used in many applications like automatic switching of appliance on detecting light and security system. Next, this circuit can be used in alarm system where increasing intensity of light will trigger the alarm. Finally, it can also be used in cardboard or wall drops. When the door is open, the light will automatically turn on.